struggles will not end until our life ends. They're an inherent part of our incarnatory journey, right? So rather than insisting that the struggle stops, what we're considering here is how do I use the pain of this struggle to create suffering by the unconscious thoughts that are really blaming, usually myself, uh, you know, even blaming someone else is no better than blaming ourselves, right? It, rather than just taking a step to the side and looking at them, and like in my case, uh, I'm just feeling hopeless right now. I mean, totally hopeless. I don't care anymore. What the fuck? You know, I don't care who's going to miss me. I just don't care. I give up. Right? Wow. I mean, I, it's it's not a daily occurrence, but it's several times a week. <laughs> so what we're considering is not to get fooled by the intensity of our distress, right? The more intense it is, the more likely we are to blame ourselves find fault with our inability to let it go or you know I know I should stop and just be still and drop deeper into myself but I can't do it right now right or... so let's try this uh, let's go back inside for a moment and just allow some recent distress to rise up just as it is feeling the ground under your feet feeling the container of this circle all around you and just take a moment and notice the distress without getting too close to it And visualize yourself just reaching for the distress, holding it in your hands, and just gently teasing it apart, pulling it apart, looking for a thought that's in the distress. It's in there. Take another moment, and if you haven't connected with the thought yet, see if the thought is, I can't, I don't know how, what's wrong with me, I'll never get this. Yet if you can, see if you can just keep gently coming to the thought under this specific distress that's yours, your recent distress. And even if you think you already know this thought, just look at it with fresh eyes. Gently visualize yourself pulling it apart with your hands. Maybe there's another thought inside this thought. Just 
Just breathing into the stress now with some gratitude for whatever came to you, whatever it was, there's value in it. You can trust that. Gently bringing yourself back. 